<laughs> what the fuck is this place? <laughs> it looks like it looks like the entertainment room on a cruise ship <laughs> where a tribute act turns up. <laughs> and the tribute act has turned up on all of the Bee Gees. <laughs> <laughs> and then, I bet Jane McDonald's been fingered in here somewhere. <laughs> 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 So, uh, here I am in, I feel like I'm always in Manchester. Uh, I'm in Alderley Edge, which I think is where loads of minted footballers live. And I'm gigging at a pub called the Churchill Tree, because apparently Winston Churchill planted a tree here. This is my life. Sneaky ancient royal pervert of the week. Uh, and I know already, I've been watching a few of you looking at me, and I know people have been thinking, I'm not sure about this guy as he comes up here. Looks like he's not supposed to be headlining the night. Looks like he's probably one of the characters out of a murder mystery room on the other part of the grounds. Colonel Mustard's arrived. It's a bit of a fucking big candlestick. <laughs> Why is that there? <laughs> I'm supposed to be head. I, I didn't ask for any of this shit. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> Why other comedy clubs have a fucking coat rack on the stage? <laughs> I've driven from London for this, and I know, right? And this is how comedy clubs work, right? You lot, I know, I've read up on you, I've been on Wikipedia, right? You've all got loads of money, right? Normally what happens is the comedian comes on stage, they've got all the power. You lot are like, that's a shit cheap suit. Fuck off, mate. <laughs> I've done my research, there's 300 millionaires in this area, right? Which means statistically, one person in this room could change my career for me. <laughs> I think it might be that man in the white suit, in the white shirt, who looks like he owns uh, TK Maxx. <laughs> <laughs> to be honest, I'm only here because I want to steal one of these paintings because I reckon they're worth something. <laughs> I've been looking for the fucking tree. Does anyone know which one it is? Is that it? Wait. Is it one of those two? Have we got fences around them? Is this it? <laughs> this is unbelievable! <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> Fucking Churchill! <laughs> What's for dinner, mummy? Crumbs! So, what I really liked about this gig, other than the fact that I was headlining, because as you know, I love and think it's such an honour to headline a weekend club gig. Um, what I liked about this was that um, I was being, I was getting to play like an asshole quite a lot. Do you know what I mean? Like I really like going on and complaining and pretending I'm bigger than the gig and being a bit of a brat. And I got to do that in this gig and it was a lot of fun. Anyway, now time for some cheeky modern Churchill art. <laughs> Hey, hey, hey. 